What's going on everybody? Welcome to a Thursday video. So today's gonna be pretty fun. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna meet with a buddy, uh, Bo. If you guys saw the bolt build uh, thing video, this is what the thumbnail looked like. If you guys have seen that video, that guy. I'm gonna go meet up with him. We're gonna do some photos and probably grab some lunch and ride around Atlanta. It should be a pretty chill, cool day. Figured I'd bring you guys along with. So without further ado, I'm gonna use Probably the probably the street triple because that's my favorite bike right now. Yay! I also have a goal for today's video. Uh, I think in general in my videos I talk too much. I don't know why. I like to explain things, and a lot of the times I don't think I need to explain the things. So my goal today is to do the right amount of talking and cinematic footage, hopefully to find some sort of cohesion between talking and uh, showing pretty stuff. So uh, I'm gonna stop talking. That's my goal. What's going on everybody? It's very uh, loud down here, Bo. Me and uh, Bo, this is Bo, the one I was talking to earlier. That's his bolt. Uh, so we're gonna be out taking photos today. And uh, the varsity is like this iconic uh, Atlanta thing. And the only reason uh, we came here was because of that. Uh, it is very hot today, so uh, one of the pictures I want to get is like a really industrial type photo. Varsity has these big columns and there's gonna be a couple other locations we go to. We figured uh, meet up here and try some photos here before we go into the heat of the day. Uh, so I'm gonna get the speed or speed street. I'm gonna get the street triple probably like position somewhere and see if we can get some photos, see if we can get some cool stuff. For lenses, uh, 70 to 200 Canon. Love this lens, if it's a, a recent purchase and every, every shot I take on it, I really enjoy. So uh, hopefully we can get some cool photos. And testing out a new B-roll camera, we'll see how that goes. Alright guys, so uh, so we were gonna do photos and we got a couple, um, but this now is empty. This is, oh my god, like school buses. Freaking. What is it like? Twelve? I don't know. Okay, so whatever time it is, it is varsity time. <laughs> so we're gonna go on to another location. I don't know if any good photos. I'm gonna show you guys all the good photos that I ended up liking at the end of the video. Um, we gotta find a different spot though. All right guys, hopefully the microphone's working. As you can see, this place got really crowded. Bo is going to lead me to a place that, uh, it's called Little Five Points here in Atlanta. And supposedly there's some cool graffiti shots we can get. So I don't know where Bo went. Oh, he's up there, I can see him. So that's where we're going. We're getting out of this craptacular situation. I'm telling you guys, out of nowhere, just hundreds of cars start showing up. Now, I don't really know where we're going in Little Five, so I'm going to follow Bo. Didn't last long. <laughs> oh, we're not racing? Oh, my bad. So I guess while we're headed to this next location, assuming my microphone's working, uh, one of the shots I want to get is with that really long uh, 70 to 200 lens I just showed you guys. And if you get far enough back, you can give you can take a shot that's kind of like you're looking through a mason jar at whatever you're seeing in the photo i really like the look of it and i want to that's kind of what i'm trying to get with the street triple shot today i don't know 
know if it's going to happen because it's really freaking bright, but I am certainly going to try. That's the goal, at least. And you know, maybe a, maybe a cooler shot will come up, and uh, and we'll get that one. So you never know. All right, guys. So first up, Bo is going to be taking photos of his bolt. What you working with there? Nah, thirty four hundred. It's an old camera, but it does uh, pretty good. You know what? It takes photos. So yeah, yeah. Uh, um, we've got the street back here. I think I'm going to shoot on my short lens. The one that's currently on the camera super wide because we don't have a lot of room over here. I'm just going to wait until this guy laughs and then that way you guys can appreciate it with us. Bo, say a joke. I, can't. I have no idea. He can't hear me. Yeah, there's no way. Can you? Need it. <laughs> it's not working. Hopefully we'll catch it on camera because this laugh is literally... Is it terrible or great? Both? Both. <laughs> Okay guys, it's hot as hell. Uh, we got some really dope photos, I think. Got some cool stuff for Ride Apparel that we're gonna be using. I appreciate Bo being a camera guy because putting that 10 second shutter timer, it's rough. Um, so, You're like running. <laughs> yeah, it's like beep, 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 uh, oh, beep, beep, Every beep, shot is up my rear end, also. Yeah, yeah, and this camera does weird with focusing with that. Okay, so we're done here. It's hot, so uh, we're gonna do some lunch. And I think we're gonna try we're gonna go downtown to try to get an alley type thing. Yeah, so we're gonna try an alley shot next. And after that, I'll show you guys all these photos. So uh, we're gonna go eat food. Okay, we ate and uh, I'm full off of water and a gyro. <laughs> or a gyro from American Deli. It's good times. Gyro. Since uh, this genius doesn't have a... What do you need? It's a USB-C cable. Oh, yeah. No, bro, I lost. His session can't be charged now because he doesn't have a USB-C cable. So we're gonna run in Best Buy, then we'll leave. Okay, I'm leaving Best Buy because I will continue to buy things if I stay in there any longer. Bo's getting his cable, and then we're going to go find this last spot to take some photos. Alright guys, we've ate, we've cooled down. Now we've got to go find this one last shot because I have not got my industrial photo yet. I still want to get that photo, so I know of a uh, place that I've, I've gone before to do photos. And uh, I'm going to try to find it there. It's in downtown Atlanta. It's going to be a little hard to find, but I have faith. You know, it's going out and doing little photo missions on the bike like this that I really want to start doing that on kind of a monthly basis for uh, ride apparel stuff. A lot of you guys know what ride apparel is. That's my kind of motorcycle apparel brand that like we, we like promoting positive motorcycle riding. And... Uh, I really like doing shoots like this, so soon I want to start finding people in Atlanta and I want to start giving people shirts, like ride apparel shirts and meeting them in the city and uh, doing photo shoots with them. And then that way ride apparel gets really dope photos that I can take and then uh, other people can like start spreading the word of ride apparel because there's so much negative going on in the world with motorcycling right now. I feel like it's helpful. I got a little sketch, huh? Yeah, he thread the needle there, didn't he? Just a little bit, just a little bit. So I thought I found the perfect road, and I did, because it looks like absolute shit. But the second we get on it, people just start driving on it. Like these people, what are they doing? This, look at this road, look at it. There is a plate in the road. It's fucking jacket. Look at it. Would you just look at it? That does not stop people of Atlanta. Um, okay, so the big shot I've been wanting to do this whole time, this really long shot and have the street triple, this, can I step on this? I can't, okay. Uh, the street triple just like far away from the lens and like shallow depth field. I think it's gonna look dope. I just need people to stop coming onto the road. So, <sighs> pray for us, my God. That street, though. Well, not not literally the street, but like the. Okay. Whoa. That's 
so pretty. Look at the, see what happens? We come out here to do photos and then we Alrighty guys, I think we uh, got the shot. Bo ended up getting this dope shot of uh, the bolt down there and through much struggle, trial and tribulation, we got the street triple in the middle of the road. Hopefully those shots turned out. So what I'm gonna do now is cut to me at the office uh, cause I gotta get all these photos edited cause I don't know what they look like now, obviously. And uh, we'll kind of talk about them after that. But for now, that will be the end of where Bo is in the video. So leave a, leave a thumbs up if like that's your high five to to Bo. And uh, if we get enough likes, he'll be in more videos. <laughs> you obviously didn't read the uh, comments in the last video. What did it say? Hashtag Bo in more videos. Oh, there you go. You're welcome. Oh, no. Prove it. Prove it with a like button. <laughs> huh? All right, guys. We're going to uh, cut to the... Oh, now the clouds are going to come over and the harsh sun's going to go away. Oh, God, feels so good. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the office when we're editing all the photos we just took. See you there. Alrighty guys, so we're back in the office. I have been sitting here going through the photos and I'm gonna show you guys the top photos that we ended up taking that I ended up liking the most. Uh, maybe some little background. So first off, there's this one because the bike was peeking past the corner. I feel like this is a really good shot. Uh, kind of dark, kind of grungy looking feel. Freaking love it. I really like the positioning of this shot. I wish the cars weren't behind it, but you know, what can you do? This one kind of felt like a street triple ad. Uh, there's little garbage by the bottom right of the tire. I could probably take that out in Photoshop if I really wanted to. Just, I thought this one was pretty funny. This one was actually one of my favorite ones that I took of Bo at that coffee shop. Uh, I love the fact that I cut off the ground so you don't have that really overexposed ground, but I felt like there's really good contrast in this photo. That was probably one of my favorite ones that I took of Bo. So here's an example of one I took of Bo where I did put the ground in it and you can see that harsh change between the ground and the transition to the shaded wall. I do think it kind of pops Bo out a lot. So I, I really like this one. I still like the other one a little bit more though. And here's one of the shots Bo took of me. Got that ride apparel going. Okay, so there's this one too and I was just kind of leaned against the wall. And then we made a joke is like, well, what if you tried to do like a 90 degree angle with the legs? And then this ended up happening. I'm like, you know what? Other than the fact that it looks like I'm taking a shit, I think this one's absolutely solid. <laughs> I, I really like this photo. Um, again, one of the jokes we had going on there at the location was the streets is rough. Uh, so I, <laughs> I thought this was a really good photo to kind of sum that whole situation up. So towards the end of the day shooting, we kind of found this alley and I got this photo. This was probably the best photo I got for that kind of really grungy, uh, shallow depth of field shot. I'm still not 100% happy with this, so I'm still in the search for that one grungy road shot. I feel like this one could have been good, but I don't know, just it, it doesn't have that dark feel that I needed. And that could have been the weather, that could have been the settings, I could have had a little off. So wasn't too happy with the the one big shot that I kind of wanted but that's okay because I got some other shots that I'm really happy with and uh, yeah of all the shots we took those are probably the ones that I liked the most obviously we took way more shots than this uh, but that's it for uh, this video guys if you guys enjoyed this kind of like I want to call these uh, photo missions if uh, you guys like this type of video I would love to keep doing these uh, I can go out with Heather I can go out with Bo I could go out by myself if I need to and I can just go out and do photos and I, you know, talk about the photos and I you know I talk about the cameras if you guys want me to. 
Um, but yeah, I had a really good time. Me and Bo had a phenomenal day uh, riding around and doing photos. So if this is something you guys like, let me know by hitting that like button. Let me know in the comments what you think about it. And if you guys enjoy it, maybe we will start adding these uh, in the future. If you guys aren't fans of the photo stuff, just look for the titles of the video. I'm going to start titling these photo missions, and that way you'll know when I'm talking about photos if you don't give a shit about photography, which I totally understand. But anyways, guys, I'm Chase on Two Wheels. This has been photo mission number one. Uh, semi-success. <laughs> I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.